Here's all you need to know about all five source links and how to automate them. The first and the cheapest option is agronomic source link. It will produce 20 source every time a crop advances to a next growth stage and 45 in case it's a source berry. Not the fastest option, but ok for the early game. The good news is it can become absolutely busted if you use it with a mystical agriculture farm. This will fill the jar in less than a minute. The jar capacity is 10,000 SERS. I'm showing you these numbers so it will be easier for you to decide which SERS link to use. The next one is Mycelial SERS link. It consumes food items yielding from 15 to 150 SERS per food item depending on its properties, or 70 in case of SERS berries. This one is easily automated if you have botany pots. Just make a set of pedestals, place pots on top and put SERS berries inside. The only downside is it's pretty slow, so you might need multiple of these. Volcanic source link uses fuel to operate, producing 1000 source per 60 items your fuel smells, which is 10% of the jar by the way. Once again, we are using pedestals, now connected with the tank holding lava and make it so the bucket cycles between the tank and the pedestal. If you want to get more violent, you can use Vitalik source link. This one utilizes both baby mob growth and mob deaths to generate source. As you might have already guessed, it will work best with your mob farm. It will generate 200 source per dead mob. Decent choice if you have a powerful mob farm. The last and the most complex one is the alchemical source link. It uses different potions from potion jars to produce source. To easily automate this, I can think of two options. The first is to use it on a mob farm with witches, utilizing numerous healing potions. The second option is to use Drigmis farming treasure goblins, as they yield a lot of different potions too. For basic potions like this, it will produce 4 to 500 source per bottle. If you know some even more cheap and efficient ways to produce source, let us know in the comments. That's it. See ya!